Uh, Cochise County is uh, about 6,200 square miles, located in southeast Arizona, next to the Mexican border and New Mexico. When you have a, an agrarian society of people who have lived here for a long time, ranchers, farmers, you'll find that as one uh, recent immigrant, I should say, from uh, Oklahoma said when he came here, he said, I've never seen such a family-friendly area. You know, people are inviting me to their homes, they're inviting me to their birthday parties, and I don't know these families, but they're very uh, encompassing. And I think you'll find that, that here in Southeast Arizona, that's one of our finest qualities, is the fact that we're a very family-oriented society. What brought me to Cochise County was, uh, I lived in Tucson, grew up in Tucson, and um, would come down here uh, in my younger years and thought it was just, quote, a neat place to be. And so my wife and I started coming down here. Actually, uh, the first time would be uh, several years on Christmas Eve. We'd come down here and stay at a local hotel, and they'd have a fire going, and we'd go out and talk to the locals, and it was just a great place to be. And after a while, we bought a house and came down on weekends, and then uh, we bought a different house and decided, oh, what the heck, and so we moved. I really enjoy being near my family. I like raising my kids in an environment that has urban aspects to it, but is also rural. So they get to know our Mexican heritage and our culture because we have Douglas nearby. They get a little bit of the American culture in Bisbee with foods and music and outings, and they get that environmental aspect in Sierra Vista where we go hiking and we go bird watching and we go bike riding. And for kids nowadays, I think it's very important to realize that technology, while great and amazing, is not everything. And that being outside is important and being tied back to their culture is important. So um, Cochise County has provided a professional opportunity for growth and a personal fulfillment to raise a family in a safe environment. I've brought uh, creativity to the Cochise County work environment uh, by really empowering our employees to work at their fullest potential, to work in collaborative teams. Uh, that's made a significant difference in having a, a group of people that creatively solves problems and, and is willing to, to take some risks. The reason that I work for Cochise County is for the opportunities that this county has offered me. Having served in the military, it was really important to me to be in a job where I went back to public service. Serving my country was great and it, pro it provided me opportunities to travel and to learn and being a medic really connected me to everybody that I served with. And when I came back to the county, it was important for me to find a job where I can continue to serve my community in a special way that I felt that I was making a difference, just like I did when I served in the Army. Cochise County has made a number of uh, really strong partnerships uh, to address environmental issues and ensure that we protect the wonderful land and environment that really makes Cochise County a unique place. Those partners include uh, uh, leaders at Fort Huachuca, our local municipal leaders and uh, mayors and managers, uh, department heads from across the county and other municipalities. The partnership between the city of Bisbee and the uh, county of Cochise is uh, very strong. Uh, we get together at least monthly with the city manager, myself as mayor, our local supervisor and the county administrator. We discuss common problems and we discuss common solutions. My experience with Cochise County is, has been wonderful. Um, the, the county has been really the only agency that has been involved with the conservation and water issues down here for the last 20 years. They're absolutely on top of what needs to happen as, for growth as well as for rural areas and ranching and farming. The Nature Conservancy has also been a, an extremely integral partner for us in addressing uh, water resources uh, in and around uh, Sierra Vista and the Sierra Vista subwatershed and protecting the San Pedro River, which is uh, part of what makes Cochise County such an incredible place uh, to live and, and recreate. 
What keeps me in Cochise County uh, is a lot of different things, both personal and professional. From the professional side, though, I would say that we have an amazing partnership and momentum towards really demonstrating some solutions here for water management that can really serve as a template for the West. I think there's some essential ingredients that we've created here, if you will, towards a solution that are very transferable to other places. Those ingredients are things like um, making sure that there's adequate information available for decision making, using predictive tools that can actually forecast what is the benefits of different options related to water management, and then being able to select options that actually, that actually meet the needs of both local communities and of, of interests like the conservation community in terms of keeping our rivers flowing. The water recharge projects, and it, it's been a big benefit to us, but the, the bottom line was is it's a benefit to the San Pedro River as well as the San Pedro Basin. And so the community is probably gonna get a bigger effect out of it than we are. This is a, a beautiful city in an incredible county down the southeast part of Arizona that people don't really know about. This is uh, not desert. This is, uh, in fact, we're the other mile high city, so come on down and experience it.